Hello everyone, in this video we are going to discuss about marine full electric propulsion power system. Here uh, this example shows a uh, representative marine off ship electric power system with this base load and the hotel load, both thrusters and the electric propulsion. Here uh, these are the principal components of the system. First one is the 30 MVA gas turbine, rotor, uh, uh, round rotor alternator and the 5 MVA diesel generator and salient port, uh, salient pole alternator and 11.5 MVA base load and the 6 MVA water load that is a switched water load and 20 MVA average value propulsion rectifier here and then 1 MVA direct all night starter and the squirrel gauge bow thruster. Uh, these are all the uh, blocks we are uh, used to construct uh, this uh, full electric uh, propulsion power system for uh, ma marine system. These are uh, gas turbine block. In this gas turbine block, it's used a turbine um, and governor and gas turbine alternator. This is a 30 mil, uh, 30 mil uh, MVA. Here it is in the this library is taken from uh, uh, this symbolic li library block. Where here where it is available this block you can see here. This is the library link. Check uh, where, where it is available. In this uh, here, here uh, this is a library synchronous library. If you have uh, how to find this uh, block, for example, here synchronous machine round rotor. Just you type here synchronous synchronous. This is a machine router. It is already come uh, uh, displayed here. These are uh, what are the uh, names with uh, synchronous. Here we need synchronous uh, machine ro round rotor. Just click it. Here you can get this one. Okay, don't confuse with uh, how, it, uh, how the block is coming here. Here itself uh, the rated pa parent power we can uh, uh, apply here. Uh, in this manner you can get. Then um, uh, similarly it is taken from uh, where, where it is a library block can see this is a double uh, e library how we how we, how we can see this library without uh, go, without go going with this library browser just you type in command window command prompt uh, be underscore library here these are all the components will come in the, under this uh, my electrical library this electromechanical uh, block is there in this electromechanical block there are synchronous uh, uh, rotors are there. Here uh, synchronous machine field circuit and the synchronous machine measurement, synchronous machine model 1.0, 2.1 and uh, the normal one synchronous machine salient pole uh, model. Based on that you can uh, you can construct this one. Uh, then uh, this is a diesel generator. There is a uh, diesel generator is a 5 milliwa 5 MVA. Here it is also uh, taken from this uh, synchronous library. Here in this model the subsystem shows this uh, 5 MVA diesel generator block. In this uh, diesel generator block um, uh, uh, with uh, salient uh, pole rotor. This is a salient pole rotor uh, parameterized for fundamental or standard per unit parameters. Here, uh, here itself we can give the rated apparent power. Here rated apparent power given here. You see the uh, we leave it as uh, default values. The rated apparent power, rated voltage and rated electrical frequency and number of pole pairs are there. Uh, here also you can apply uh, impedance that is a stator resistance and stator leakage reactance uh, depending upon your requirement you can uh, make the changes time constant saturation and initial conditions here. Uh, then uh, similarly in gas turbine also you can uh, you can give the uh, apparent power that is a rated apparent power here the, uh, we are using 30 MVA so that we are, we are giving 30 uh, E6 value that is a rated voltage is 4160 voltage and rated electrical fre frequency is 60 hertz. Based on that, we can apply the values. There is a synchronous uh, gas turbine alternator uh, 30 MVA and similarly 5 MVA diesel generator with the salient pole alternator. Then this is the uh, base load that is 11.5 uh, MVA base load. It is uh, parameterized parameterization by specified uh, rated power and also one more option specify the component values directly. Here we can specify the uh, rated power and component structure is series RL circuit, RL circuit structure and rated voltage is 4160 volt. 160 volt. Um, then uh, similarly you can give the parasitics uh, conductance and initial, uh, initial conductance values you can see. Here this base load is Y connected load. Uh, it is a Y connected load model uh, uh, load. This impedance of uh, each phase can be represented as uh, 
uh, either series or parallel combination of resistor and capacitor here we are using this rl combination series rl combination similarly uh, the water load the water load is uh, 6 mva switched water load here uh, here this is a real power 6 mva and uh, here also the component structure is r previous one is rl structure uh, this uh, this also y connected load uh, the impedance of uh, each phase can be represented uh, series or parallel combination so that here using component structure is uh, r and this is the bo both resistors it is um, uh, descent with uh, this is one of the subsystem uh, with uh, this both structure both resistors here uh, this induction machine squirrel gauge this uh, induction machine with squirrel gauge rotor parameters using this fundamental parameter um, uh, parameters that is a uh, one mva direct online starter um, and uh, started with this squirrel gauge uh, both resistor here also these are where you leave it as uh, these default values the kind kindly note on the rated upper and power and uh, rotor voltage all things we must select here this squirrel gauge single gauge single uh, squirrel gauge uh, type is uh, selected here it's um, uh, to, uh, another one option is uh, double squirrel gauge okay, here uh, zero in uh, sequence are include include here and uh, initialization options all these values are uh, given here um, uh, based on your uh, requirement we can make changes and this is a propulsion uh, propulsion load profile and also this is forward uh, pl port forward cable and port aft cable and port midship cable this, these are the uh, connections to design uh, this marine full electric propulsion system just to you know you, uh, you need to uh, run this one we can get the uh, plot uh, for a diesel generator and gas turbine uh, power outputs and also uh, the sequence of uh, um, uh, events uh, during the simulation we can uh, uh, you can see now this example pa particularly for this uh, simulation going on it takes some more time uh, so that um, by, by using this uh, design um, is useful for uh, modeling of uh, um, marine full electric uh, propulsion power system here this example represents uh, a yeah, um, off ship electrical power system with this type of loads there is a base load water load and uh, bro bro both thrusters and electrical proportion here yeah, now it is output is coming uh, just uh, these are the power output of uh, this gas turbine and uh, diesel generator here you can see the events for example it uh, 10 seconds is there a time a time and per um, time versus uh, unit power unit per and this is a time versus your uh, watts, power watts, power in terms of watts. You can see um, the, um, the sequence of uh, events uh, during one simulation period is first for example 10 second uh, water load is uh, disconnected and 20 second uh, the propulsion begins uh, ramping up here and 30 seconds um, uh, full power uh, ahead and 40 second and uh, propulsion begins uh, ramping down here uh, then at 50 second uh, the bro both thrusters uh, start up and say at 60 seconds uh, the water load is connected now based on that you can analyze this uh, marine full electric uh, propulsion power system also you can make this um, you, you can see the code here how to um, uh, plot simulation result from uh, this model simulink model uh, this is a plot uh, below um, shows the diesel generator and gas generator power output here you can see here uh, this is a get simulation result and the plot the result here itself we can make the changes to uh, interact your um, program okay where based on that you can see and also we can see with the simulation result with the interactive ssc explorer every um, 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 uh, design we are um, again post in uh, via youtube with this uh, uh, ssc explorer block based on uh, by using this block you can um, see the simulation result with this interactive app see here at by each and every node you can see the um, output and we can analyze this output this average um, value uh, propulsion road in terms of volt and in terms of voltage and current and resistance here 
and uh, similarly average value proportion uh, proportion rectifier uh, another side this one <coughs> and this is the base load uh, with neutral point you can zoom it you can um, clearly you can see this is above both thrusters output at the point of as uh, asynchronous machine measurement and uh, this is above uh, both both the thrusters with this angular portion off and angular angular torque angular velocity and power dissipated and similarly you can uh, see each and every block it is a ideal uh, torque source so the next one is a diesel generator block <coughs> in this diesel generator block there is a avr and excitor voltage and diesel generator alternator that is a 5 mva alternator angular uh, torque angular velocity power dissipated values all things you can analyze uh, we can um, verify the power outputs at a um, diesel generator and gas turbine also uh, uh, verify this uh, load that is 11.5 mva base load and also this uh, 6 mva uh, <coughs> switched water load here you can see the water load water load power uh, combination that is at neutral point and uh, um, uh, y impedance point this means uh, just you zoom it you can see and the next one is a uh, water load breakers space splitters uh, here there are two space splitters are uh, uh, incorporated here it is a port uh, apt cable uh, um, uh, face splitter values you say at point n1 and n2 and the general this is a transmission line transmission line node inductors and um, uh, node beta values based on that you can see also you can compare using uh, simulink data inspector tool just you compare what all the um, nodes uh, nodes present in what is the power what is the electrical uh, reference what is the gas turbine power output and water load power output all things you can compare with this uh, sim simulink data uh, inspector block it is available in uh, this one there's a data inspector every time you run this model just based on the um, uh, run model we can compare your outputs by using this uh, data inspector um, uh, um, uh, block to view your logged data uh, kindly uh, subscribe my channel you are all uh, new subscriber to watch my channel kindly subscribe my channel support please support us thanks for watching thank you